you were saying that um talking about like denazifying Ukraine now isn't as crazy as what it was a few weeks ago. What 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 do you know about that? What what have you heard about that? I I know quite a lot about it, interestingly. I mean Are you a Nazi? Everybody's saying that <laughs> I am. I'm a closet Nazi. <laughs> Uh, I won't do a see Kyle. No. I get us uh, cancelled <laughs> wherever this goes. Yeah. But yeah, unfortunately, I'm not a Nazi, but I, I do take a strong interest in Nazism because I'm a massive history yeah, geek. Yeah, yeah. People love and, a good murder. Uh, yeah. And Until it happens to them. Hitler were one of the best murderers in the world. <laughs> I mean, any country that has a national holiday to celebrate the World War II Nazi puppet leader, Stefan Bandera, has a strong Nazi problem going on. I mean, Ukraine's national holiday to celebrate that guy. And that guy was a straight up Nazi, worked for Hitler, set up concentration camps. He said horrible things about killing Jews, killing Poles, killed thousands of them. Straight up Nazi. And since 2014, They've had a national holiday every year to celebrate this guy. Not only that, they've built hundreds of statues of him all around the country. They've renamed football stadiums after him. That, that, that's a strong signal that you just don't have a few fringe Nazis in your country. That, that shows that your government is in bed with Nazis. Your government is kind of got a bit of a problem going on. Well, what's all this? And what, team people just... Yeah? Well, sorry, what's all this stuff about the... Jewish population then over there, what's what's that about then? If they so the Jewish the, the Jewish president, yeah. But I thought they said yeah. they had so. Yeah. So I mean the the Jewish president. So the presidential elections and the parliamentary elections are two separate things. So interestingly, like at a local governmental level, in specific towns and regions, you'll see a much more kind of strong prominence of this like Nazism and right-wing infatuation and I'd say the president is kind of like a, a bridge between this kind of right-wing fascist ideology within Ukraine and the more like liberal leaning left and interestingly yeah to, to see this relationship between Nazism and a Jewish leader is, is quite crazy but what's really interesting is that when you think about what country in the world acts most like Nazis in the modern age? It actually is the Jewish state of Israel, which <laughs> fucking hell. really, really do act like Nazis in, in the way that they, they treat the Palestinians in Gaza. So things have been turned on the head a bit. And interestingly, Israel has a good relationship with, uh, with Ukraine. Right. It's really interesting. It's really interesting. Yeah, interesting is the word, is, is the magic word of like, yeah, yeah. I think you said a clusterfuck, and that's the best way to describe it, man. Yeah, because we've had this going on um, for what eight years now of of the of the bombing sort of situation, right? Um, and if we're talking about like Nazism, right? Just the whole idea of like we're this and we're going to absolutely like dominate this, and or or these people are like, you know, subhuman or whatever, right? Um, it doesn't it doesn't even need to connect to what happened in the Second World War anymore in terms of, like, what's going on inside. It's just an ideology, right? So, um, yeah, it's probably going to... But are, are you saying that they're actually, like, they're actually bringing ideas from actual Nazis or just a just a general kind of fascist sort of mindset so I mean Ukraine never had like much of a national identity the only time it really got to get a strong national identity was when Hitler enabled them to do it in World War II and set up like a puppet state and had Stepan Bandera as a leader so Ukrainian nationalists have like nothing to kind of glorify apart from this really so it's kind of like unfortunately that's what they have to look up to yeah and there is like nazi insignia they use and stuff like that but i feel like that's just kind of 
because that's all they've got really from the past. That's all the history that they've got. And there's so many parallels with Croatia, um, with the breakup of Yugoslavia in 1991, the same clarification of the Nazi puppets of the past, of the Ustasha regime, the ones that killed hundreds of thousands of Serbs, gypsies, uh, Jews in concentration camps. And even today, now in Croatia, you see these uh, these people being glorified. Yeah. So I think it's just about yeah not having anyone to kind of look up to in history, and that's the only ones they have. Yeah, pretty messed up. Um, do mm, you still messed up, man? Do you still follow what happens in in Serbia? Yeah, yeah, man. I got, I got my finger on pulse in Eastern Europe. What what they what are they thinking? What have they been thinking lately about all this stuff? So, so Serbia is the, the the only country in Europe apart from Belarus which hasn't sanctioned Russia. Um, Serbia is probably the only country in Europe where there's been demonstrations in support of Russia in the capital. Yeah, with the Z. With and the, with the Z, going Z, Russian flag. I mean, in Serbia, it's easy to support Russia because all you've got to do is turn the Serbian flag upside down <laughs> and there you go, Russian flag. <laughs> so it's like we're made to be allies. But a lot of our support, it isn't anything against the Ukrainian people in at all it's more to do with the fact that we were bombed by nato and we've been part of this that we've been victims of this like geopolitical chess match yeah nato bombed us into submission and built the biggest nato base in europe in the serbian region of kosovo because they bombed us out of there so we know what nato are all about we know what they want to do so that's why we're so strongly opposed to um the, the meddling that they've done and we're just urging people to just have a bit more a bit more rationality when it comes to reacting to this if you like this you can check out other stuff other videos on this channel and future stuff that's going to happen get more long form keep the shorter ones going yeah 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 bye bye <laughs>